Hi boys and girls. So last week we did addition in our math and that is where we had a small number and then we added or combined another small number to create a bigger number. So what I just showed you was 2 plus 2 equals 4 if we put them together. Now we're going to make our brain go backwards. We're going to reverse it and we're going to start with the bigger number and then we're going to end up with a smaller number or a part of the whole number. So if I say I have four straws and then I gave three of them away to a friend, how many do I have left? So if I start with four and I take away one, two, three, how many do I have left? I have one. All right, let's do another one. So let's start with a higher number because you guys are so smart. Let's start with, let me count how many I have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I have seven straws. And then I was really thirsty. So that day I used three of them. So I used one, two, three of them. How many do I have left? I have one, two, three, four. So we're going to say seven take away three is four. All right, let's start with the same number. We're gonna start with seven again. And my friend needed two for her lemonade. So seven take away two. Now how many do I have left? I have one, two, three, four, five. So seven take away two is five. All right, boys and girls, you're going to do this with your parents. You're going to use anything that you have at your house, anything that you can count. It can be straws. It can be candy. It can be um, anything that you can count that would work for you. All right, have fun with this.